Defenders. Your journey ends here. Hi everyone and welcome to this new channel. My name is Natoji and today this is a Genshin Impact review about three parts. First, the device's requirement. Two, the pre-registration process. And three, all the rewards explained for you. So Genji Impact is an action role playing. This is a cross play, cross platform. This is a gacha and open world. Now let's get into it. First, before to speak about the registration process and rewards, you must check if your device can take it. So here, I will put in the description below the official link, the latest update about the recommended device specification. As you can see here, you will have a look for the PC. You will have a look also for Android devices, iOS here, and of course the PlayStation 4. You just need to reserve 30 gigabyte of space so be sure to check this before to pre-register because if your device cannot take it this will be useless first you need to lead on the official website genchi.mioyo.com and here i will put it in the link description as well and here you can see we already are at 2.8 million of travelers registered so this look good you will click on the pre-registering button and before to speak here about the rewards you can see the goal is 3 million so we are pretty close here to get all of those you have the pre-registering button on the website you must do register on the website in order to get it all so be aware about it because a lot of players just pre-order on the app store whatsoever it's not enough you must create an account with that just to ensure you will get it so here it's a very straightforward registration if you look uh, closely at uh, here the pre-registration it will ask for whatever the platform device you can play on so let's say ios and android and here you will put your continent either america whatever and you can register after uh, with your email address in some country with your phone as well and then they will send you a verification card and you will create your account here on the platform and this will allow you to get all the rewards from the pre-registration and also from the ongoing events so now let's speak about first the rewards here pretty simple for the three million this is a lot of resources uh, for your hero, for your weapon, etc. And most importantly, we have a total of six acquainted fates just right there once we reach the goal of three million. Now let's see a little bit more details about the full extended list of what you get from just pre-registering. And if we reach the three million, when you will create a character, you will receive up to 10 acquaint fate. Uh, from the 3 million which we should achieve and later on if there are more than 10 million trade registration across all region and platforms and we reach adventure rank 10 we will receive another 10 aquan fate which you will use to summon some new heroes on the top of that there is an initial top up bonus so if you are spending money buying gems they call it the genesis crystal here you whenever you top up for the first time at each amount you will be able to get a double uh, so a double value so for people who pay to support pay to progress pay to win uh, it will be nice here after there will be a four star character this is Xiangling, and she's actually pretty good pretty strong and uh, once you complete the people's choice the spiral abyss event i believe this is stage three three uh, you will get her um so for free so this is a very new uh very cool gift after you have also the four stars uh here character noel so character noel will be a guarantee four star hero uh as you can see with the beginner's wish is 20 percent off and the first 10 set is guaranteed to include a four star character noel so if you don't pull nothing on the 10 uh, first pool at least you will get a noel after there is the wing glider so the wing glider is those nice 
um, th those nice wings for you to you know travel the map. It's um, it's uh, wearable from any character, so this is pretty cool actually. So this will be also given when the game will go live. After you have get ready for the road, we are going to speak about it. This is the ongoing event, and uh, you can earn you know four stars weapon and artifact, and we will see which one uh, you should focus on. After there is also a four star catalyst prototype. So once you complete all experience investigation in the adventurer handbook, you obtain a four star catalyst prototype. I must know that the catalyst are for the maid. This is the maid weapon. So this is actually pretty cool. And after they will be in the adventure on the rank reward. Uh, once you reach adventure 10, you will obtain a four star sword. So once again, some free bees just for the pre-registration on the website. This is what you get. Now to finish this video, let's speak about the ongoing Get Ready for the Road event. I will put the link in the description below. So here, once you are registered to the website, you come here with your account and basically it will give you some additional freebies. So before to speak about the price, I just want to tell you one thing. This is the schedule. You must play here. You have the play button before the 28th of September. Okay, after for all the details of the event, I let you check in uh, in the page. It will be easier to understand. But first, you must do it before the 28th of, of uh, September. And you have to do 25 pool. Here, as you can see, the luck store, one luck is one pool. And it's pretty easy to do. You can do about seven per day. As you can see here, I already played. But once you get here, uh, you can every single day here, it refresh for the site visiting. So up to five pool. Each time you go visit YouTube, you get one pool. And for the sharing task, one time here, for example, for the Facebook, you don't even need to 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 to. To share you just click on the button as you can see here I go on the page I come back here and I'm good and I'm done so this is you will do it easily it remains 14 days but do not forget to do your pull before the 28th of September now let's speak quickly about the price review here as you can see there is different prizes with different tier class price class a b c d e and after here you have a loading system a rating loading rating system means each item at a cost 10 a value at 10 the b value at 6 etc and total you will get you can load your inventory with a value of 16 so now let's speak about and coming back here to the items that you want and this will be those here. Straightforward, you need the Gladiator's Destiny and the Gladiator's Nostalgia because both of them provide flat 20% the attack. So this is ensure guarantee. So those are the most favorite here on the list, hands down. That's it. After, if you don't get them, uh, you have the Bard's Arrow and the Feather in the B category. You can take those. The A are not too bad, the prototype, but they are uh, average and obtainable later in the story. And at least at the end, what you prefer, you forget about C, D, E, you just take the E here. Uh, Wanderer's Advice, Sweet Madame, Fine Enhancement or which are to level up, you know, uh, gears, etc., characters, and also heal the weapons. So those are good to take. So Ideally, you've got the two gladiators here, and after you pick either one fine or one wanderer's advice or whatever you, you decide, and you have 16 value of load point here on your inventory. After, at the end, you will go at the inventory preview and you will pick up, so for example, don't worry, you can, you can, you know, add to traveling and you can take it out afterward, confirm, you can take it out so you won't waste nothing. But you prefer to wait until the end and you will load your inventory with all your item. So let's, uh, you know, for example, here I put, you know, all the item, the values and you confirm and you confirm. And once you will reach here, as you can see later on, um, 16, then after the 28th of September, you can redeem them and get them in the game. And this is all for today. If you found the video informative and helpful, 
please feel free to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. As you understood, I will be playing and covering Genshin Impact. I already pre-registered for the mobile version. I order it, pre-order it also on the PS4. And just a quick note about it, please not, you cannot share uh, your account across PS4 and all the platforms. So just a quick note before to let you. Now, uh, what about you guys? Are you already hyped about it? Did you already pre-register? And most importantly, what are your favorite heroes? Because if you are into it already, you must know, as I do know, what kind of target I've got uh, for the game. So for sure, you will find out more Genshin uh, Impact content. I will keep my regulars, my weekly about all the games like Guardian Tales, of course. Uh, those are currently uh, my fav by far. Uh, but I will cover uh, regularly um, per week, once per week, at least Genshin at first. So thank you all for watching. I wish you all to be safe, to be well. And until next, cheers.